Now, whenever you have the term measurement, also along with this, you have accuracy and precision. Can anyone tell us what the difference is between accuracy and precision, if you can still remember? Accuracy, like the how close the result is to like the right thing, and then precision is how close they are, how close the answers are together rather than to like the goal. Okay, that's correct. That's very good. Okay, so that's right. Reed said, whenever you say accuracy, that is how close a measured value is to the actual or to the true value. Okay, so accuracy is how close your measured value is to the true value or to the actual value. But when you say precision, this is how close the measured values are to each other. They're, they might not be accurate, but they can be precise. Okay, they, they can be precise without being accurate. So, for example, you say you're measuring the boiling point of water. Okay, you all know that the boiling point of water would be 100 degrees Celsius. When you say accuracy, say your measurement is at 99.9, 99.8, or 100.1, then you'd say that your measurement is accurate. Okay, it's very close to the measure to to the actual value or to the true value. But when you say precise, your measurements are clumped together. Okay, your measurements are very close to each other. They might not be accurate. They might they might not be too close to the actual value, but they're close to each other. Okay, so say you have your measurement for boiling point of water and your measurements are 88.7, 88.6, and 88.5, okay? So you say that your measurements are precise, but they're not in any way accurate, okay? So again, accuracy is how close it is to the true value or to the actual value, and precision is how clumped they are, okay? How clumped together your measurements are. All right, now say you have this. Okay, if you are looking at number one, okay, what can you say about number one? Is it accurate? Is it precise? Is it neither? Is it both? Let's have Zambia. Is it correct? It, do I do I uh, pronounce? Yes. 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 Zambia, can you tell us? Uh, can you talk about number one? Uh, it's precise. Okay, precise because they're both they're they're all clumped together. What else? Yeah. Uh, it's in the middle. Okay, it's in the middle. So would you also say that they're they target? Okay, What'd they're hitting say? the target. They're hitting the target, and so you'd also say that that's accurate. Okay. So whenever, again, whenever the measurement hits the actual target, it's very near the actual value. Then you'd also say that it's accurate. So for number one here, you can say it's both accurate or they're, they're both accurate and precise. Accurate because they're hitting the, the target, they're hitting the right value, the actual value, and also precise because they are very close to each other, they're clumped. Okay, so that's both accurate and precise. What about number two, Lynn? So again, number one, we say it's both accurate, they're both accurate and precise. Now, what about the second one? Uh, they're very precise, but they're not accurate. Okay, that's correct. They're precise because they're clumped together, but they're not accurate because they're very far from the target. Okay, so they're precise, but not accurate. Then, of course, number three here, they're not precise and they're also not accurate. Okay, not accurate because they're not hitting the target and also not precise because they are far apart from each other. Okay, so that's accuracy and precision still part of your measurement. 